Hey guys, welcome to Arab Instruments. My name is Niri and uh, many of you asked us this question. What is the difference between the Arabic name and the Turkish name? So today in this tutorial, we're going to settle this score once and for all and understand all the differences between the two names. Enjoy. So, the most obvious difference is the shape. Uh, in the Turkish name, you have a mouthpiece that is called Bashpare. It comes off and your lips touch this surface. Now there are many kinds of bashpare from uh, at least three main uh, uh, materials. Plastic, and there's a, a wide variety of plastics. Our plastic bashpare is from the best plastic that can be uh, achieved. Uh, and from, you have bashpare from horn, from goat's horn and from wood. Most of the of the nays are using plastic bashpares and the professional players will go for horn bashpares. Uh, the thing is that it helps the sound to be more sharp and more dense, and more strong. The Turkish uh, ney sound is a bit similar to like a, a ship, like a big ship. So it needs this kind of mouthpiece. The second uh, difference that you see is the rings, the, the metal rings. You can get them again in a variety of shapes, colors and ornaments. And uh, besides of the beauty, it helps the reed itself to be pulled together and not be dismantled by the bashpai. Now, another main difference is the tuning. Look at the holes, you see they are very much the same, the back hole and the six holes here. But the third degree is a bit different between the Arabic ney and the Turkish ney. In the Turkish ney, the third degree, the sega note, is a bit higher. And in the uh, Arabic ney, is a bit lower. I'm talking about the quarter tone built in the ney. So, in the Arabic ney, it would be more deep, steep, and uh, stronger in a way and in the Turkish name it will be a bit more modern and a bit more European but allowing you to do also major very easily so they are tuned the same but the third degree is a bit different between the two names so the million dollar question is which one is better I think this question is not that fair. It's like asking your mother which son she prefers. Uh, both nays are premium nays made by Ahmed Abdel Ghani, especially for us. So both of them are perfect and amazing. Uh, another thing is, I think it, it has to do with the music you listen to. If you listen to Turkish music, go buy a Turkish name. If you listen to Arabic music, by an Arabic name. But in a personal uh, moment, I think, I want to say that, I think uh, when putting the lips on the reed itself and uh, the, the special tuning of the Arabic name helps me feel more connected, more human, more, more um, um, emotional. Uh, it's gentler and I think this is what we are all looking for in the end, to be more close to what we're doing and to feel it stronger. Um, it's in your hands, you're gonna enjoy both uh, and I hope to hear from you soon. Guys, I almost forgot, it's very important, please subscribe, that's the way for you to get more videos and more information. Second thing is, you're welcome to go on our website and to see the variety of nays we have. We have reed nays and plastic nays for professionals and for beginners with such a big variety of colors. So go there and choose the one you like. And I'm gonna see you on the next tutorial. Bye guys.